Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Today I'm starting my lecture with the name of Allah. It, uh, here we would gonna discuss silicate ceramics. Silicate is the material that is made up of silicone and oxygen. The basic unit of silicate is SiO4. Silicate is found in nature in the form of bulk of soils, rocks and clays and sand. These are the materials that in nature are made up of silicates. We will use the term SiO4 for negative tetrahedron for crystal structure of silicate ceramics. It is a tetrahedron in which the central one is oxygen, uh, silic silicon and the um, corner ones are oxygen atoms. The bond between silicon and oxygen is covalent. So we would not call silicates as to be ionic. And then uh, we will shift toward the, our next topic, silica. In silica, the simplest, the simplest silicate material is silicon dioxide SiO2. It is also named as silica. The structure is 3D network. It is as each oxygen at the corner is forming the uh, bond with the other tetrahedrons. So it would be a 3D structure. So as it is prop, uh, it is in proper arrangement, it would be a crystalline structure. There are two oxygen and one silicon, so the ratio between them is one ratio two. Beside this, this is a stru um, uh, stable structure as valency is the stable. Uh, the two oxygen forming minus four valency on oxygen and SiF plus four, so plus four and negative four would give stable st SiO two. Next, uh, we will talk about the polymorphic form of silica. These are the quartz, cristobalite, and tridimide. The density of quartz at room temperature is 2.65 gram per centimeter cube. SiO bond. The strong bond, uh, this is the strong as the high melting point is required for melt this is the this is 1710 celsius so you might think that this is a strong bond by high melting temperature next we will talk about silica glass silica glass is uh, nothing but uh, made up of silica but it is in amorphous form and the random randomness of structure would give us non-crystalline structure of silica glass and we can also call this view silica or vitreous silica so you can come to know that uh, silica can be in crystalline form and non-crystalline form in pure form silica it is crystalline but in form of fused silica or vitreous silica silica glass would give the um, non-crystalline structure next we will talk about uh, the network formers network modifiers and intermediates the oxide b2o3 geo2 and sio2 are network formers and uh, silica glass when added CaO and uh, Na2 oxides they are used to make windows and containers this is the application of silica glasses and uh, CaO and Na2 oxides are called network modifiers beside this Titanium oxide and Al2O3 are intermediates. These three intermediates, network modifiers and uh, the other one, network formers, are just the oxides, network uh, for modifiers and intermediates. These two intermediates and network modifiers, when added in um, silica glass, they lower the melting point and viscosity. So it's easy to make them at lower temperature. 